Lots of people have allergies, maybe up to 30% of people in developed countries. Wouldn't it be cool if we could just take a little superfood supplement and feel way better? These researchers wondered the same thing and did a nice randomized placebo-controlled trial to see if spirulina could be that supplement. Spirulina is a freshwater algae and has been used as a food and nutritional product for a long time, including by the Aztecs in Central America. In this study, they wanted to find out whether spirulina could improve allergy symptoms in adult patients. They had 150 people ages 19 to 49 that they randomized into two groups. One group took 2 grams of spirulina every day for 6 months. The other group was given starch tablets made to look the same as the spirulina and took those for 6 months. They had the patients keep a diary where they scored their allergy symptoms every week. They also had them checked out by doctors to evaluate their symptoms and also check some allergy-related physical exam findings. After six months, they collected their symptom diaries and had the same doctors check the patients again. It was double-blinded, so neither the patients nor the doctors knew what they got. Decent-looking methods on this one. A few small things missing that I would have liked to know, but sometimes that can just be word count restriction from the journals. So what did they find? Compared to placebo, spirulina was better at reducing runny nose, congestion, nasal itching, and sneezing. They wrote that the physical exams also looked better, but didn't give precise numbers in the paper. Patients rated overall effectiveness at 7.4 out of 10 compared to 3.5 with placebo, more than 100% difference. So do we trust the paper and the findings? A couple small small weaknesses, but overall a respectable piece of research. Looking at the body of literature, including studies we've covered before, it seems like taking spirulina could actually help with allergy symptoms. Check with your doctor to make sure it's safe for you, but it seems like a go. If you learned something today, please drop us a like, and if you want to learn how else spirulina might benefit your health, check out this other video.